morning guys it is saturday july 11th just got here to the gym about to head inside real quick running a little bit behind i'm working out with one of my buddies from back home his name's logan we are hitting shoulders today so gonna get some footage of this so i'll see you guys inside for this workout All right, guys, so going to be bringing you a little bit of a commentary over this shoulder workout that I did with Logan. Uh, he's about 19 or 20 years old. He works at this gym. He's a college hockey player, and this kid is strong. I've been helping him out with his macros a little bit this summer, and he has just been getting huge and strong and really proud of him for everything that uh, he's been doing, especially with chasing his goals. But um, it was also a nice change of pace to be working out with somebody that is going to be able to really push me. As you can see, uh, he's a strong kid for sure. Um, I topped out at 135, as you're going to see right here on overhead press. This is not one of my stronger lifts, but he repped 135 out real easy. Moved up to 155 and hit that for a pretty easy single. So definitely a strong kid, and it was really nice. Uh, being able to change things up and working out with a partner today. But started out with overhead presses, which is a lift that I am definitely going to be working on over these next few months as I get into a bulk. I really want to uh, strengthen up that lift and get a stronger overhead press. The second exercise that we did was some side lateral raises with the dumbbells, and then we moved into front raises with an underhand grip, with dumbbells targeting that front head of the delt. And what we did on our last set, we started out with a 35. And we did that for about 8 to 10 reps. And then we moved down to a 30, hit that for about 5 to 10 reps, or 5 to 6 reps, sorry. And then we moved down to a uh, 20 and then 15. So we did about 4 sets, about 3 or 4 drop sets to end that out. And then we just finished with some rear delts to finish out the workout. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this commentary. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this workout with Logan. Maybe get another one in before the end of the summer. And I'll see you guys in the rest of the video. All right, guys. So just got home from the gym working out with Logan. Hit shoulders. A uh, really good workout. A lot of supersets towards the end of our workout. And then uh, got home, got a package in the mail uh, from my buddy Blake down at Purdue uh, where I go to school. So uh, going to open this up and show you guys what is in here. All right, so just opened up the package, and what he sent me was one of these Fitbit zips, uh, just the small little ones that you can kind of attach to your pants or your shirt or your belt, and it'll track and wirelessly sync to an app on your phone. Uh, the Fitbit app, I'm not sure that is focused at all, but it wirelessly syncs to your phone so you can track steps, how many miles you've walked, how many calories you've burned throughout the day, and it's also got a little clock on it so you can also see what time it is if say you're not wearing a watch or if you do make an upgrade and you buy one of the higher quality Fitbits then those will, I did a little bit of research on them uh, after I opened it up, but uh, those will actually track your heart rate, they'll track your sleeping patterns, different things like that so you can make sure you're getting the most optimization out of your entire day. So um, thank you Blake, I'm excited to try this out and put it to good use. And now, about to make myself some food, get a post-workout meal, and I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, guys, so answering some emails right now, and if you guys don't know, I am a huge movie lover. If you guys watch a lot of my videos, you know I do movie reviews all the time. Um, I'm always going to the movies. I'm buying Blu-rays all the time. Uh, movies are just as much of my passion as fitness. So um, one of my clients actually just shot me an email and I'm sitting here answering him and he actually asked me to give a review on the Batman v Superman trailer that just dropped from Comic-Con. Comic-Con is this weekend and um, where they were where they kind of release a bunch of new videos or a bunch of new trailers for movies that are coming up and they just released the Batman v Superman trailer two hours ago so this is the first time I'm watching it so I figured I would hit play and kind of let you guys know what I think of it because I'm very excited for this movie so uh, here we go here is my live reaction to this Batman v Superman trailer today is a day for truth 
The world needs to know what happened and to know what he stands for. That kind of power is very dangerous. It looks like Superman's the bad guy in this movie. That is Ben Affleck. Batman. Wow. Let the record show that this committee holds him responsible. So it looks like Superman tore down one of Bruce's that's how it starts. Buildings? The fever. The rage that turns good men. Cruel. Ah, I like that. This bat vigilante is like a one-man right of terror. You don't get to decide what the right thing is. Nobody cares about Clark Kent taking on the Batman. That's interesting he has long hair here. Oh, shoot. Hey, there's Wonder Woman. That's so awesome. I love this take on Batman. Wow, Wonder Woman looks great in this movie. So awesome. Day versus night. The red capes are coming. Whoa. The red capes are coming. Wow. That's so awesome. That movie is going to be so good. Wow. I'll be the first person to admit that I was not, before this trailer, I was not as excited for this movie as Captain America 3 Civil War. That, that trailer just completely changed that. That was, that was good. You guys, if you have not seen this trailer, well, I'll put the trailer right down here when I review it, but that was, that was amazing. <laughs> so, um, needless to say, I am excited for that movie, which comes out March 25th, 2016. Blockbuster summer season is starting early next year, so that's ex <laughs> that's exciting. Oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, so there's my review on the Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice new trailer that just dropped at Comic-Con. That was good. <laughs> but going to answer some more emails, get back to work now, and, uh, Try to get all this done. Uh, it's almost 6 o'clock. UFC 189 is tonight at 8 o'clock. Uh, pretty excited for that. Just going to mentally and physically check out for the rest of the night as soon as I get a few more of these emails done and then relax. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next clip. You're supposed to come in Monday because I'm not sure what's on here.